A New York firefighter going beyond the call of duty by being an organ donor. Now one man says he's grateful that the heart of a hero lives on inside him. CNN's Brent Gingrass has more. It's, it's, it's part of me. I mean, it, it, does, it feels like it belongs there. Thank God. Uh, Richard Grell is, now uh, has the heart yeah. of a hero. Most generous donor family. I am truly sorry for the passing of your beloved family member. I was told a heart transplant was my only option for quantity and quality of life. But he only recently found that out. On your mark, get set, go. So tell me, who was Billy? What was he like as a husband, as a firefighter? I think the word I keep using for everyone is passionate and a big personality. Billy Moon, a New York City firefighter, served for two decades. When they leave the house, you know it would always be safe, I love you. Mm -hmm. And you know that there's a risk involved. He fell while preparing for a training exercise. Unfortunately, you know, it was an accident. He continues to save lives, even in death. He donated his heart, his liver, his lungs, and both of his kidneys. Five lives saved. Yeah. I would think the heart is a special one. It mm. kind of encompasses you know, everything that was him. <laughs> the kids had asked, are we going to meet the heart? We, we would really like to hear the heart. I'm taking extra special care. <laughs> of this beautiful new heart. When he wrote the letter, I was able to say, you really want to meet the man that has dad's wow. heart? And they're like, yeah. Hi. Hello, hello. God, thank you so much. Nearly a year after Moon's death, his family got that chance. Yeah, I can hear it. Awesome. I would take naps right next to my dad. And it feels like I was right next to him because when I was doing it, you hear his heartbeat. Oh. Yep. Meeting Billy's mom, I sat there and, and I thought, the heart that's inside of me was also with Billy. But his mom was the one that, been, that made the heart. So I had a direct connection to his mother. He had that philosophy of you can't take it with you when you die. And he wanted to make sure he was there for other people. I'm crying. Why are you crying? Because I'm alive. <laughs> And I'm so grateful. Thanks to one last heroic act. We did it right! Bringing Grass, CNN, New York. What a